so this is the three star trash fight with our three star lux let's do this level 17 with one revive shouldn't be that difficult it's lux lux is super strong okay observatory it's very fitting right now yeah it will clash with our power so no need all buffs are permanent it's actually pretty disgusting if you think about it oh i'll try one more reroll ls have with plus one plus one challenger ls have with plus one plus one is pretty good i want to keep at least one revive uh revive one reroll for other things so always gamble your rerolls at the start helps a lot if you get a very good power okay so lux is here everyone's here we will keep this in time okay. Okay, so we play this dude. We just have to like endure a little. That's what the Lux squad is. You just endure a little and play a six mana spell and then just beat the shit out of everyone. Yeah, we have six spell on us. That sucks. You can take a lot of damage. Unfortunate. I could have played this, yeah. But I want to actually do the six thing together. Okay, so play this. Oh, we can play this and take out one of the spiders. Can still take out one of the spiders. Oh yeah, surviving thing gets one. Yeah, so we play Lux this turn and next next turn Lux will level up. Just stun the strongest. And get okay, I thought I'd get captured. Oh uh, yeah, we skip it. Block it like this, block it like this, block it like this, Actually, block it like this. We lose one, but it's fine. Lux is all about enduring a little at the start. And then you just OTK them. Like you'll understand next turn. Okay, do I have enough mana? Oh, I have I have nine. Yeah, I can play the entire thing. Entire combo, right? So play this first. To play that, it's fine. We'll play this first. Get our mana back, full mana back, and then use the moss here. And use for the moss here. And there we go. A lux in a nutshell. <laughs> lux is beyond. Look at like how many re uh, re rallies we have. She has a world. She got it from the yeah. spell. Okay. It's fine, we have a bunch of rallies. You have no and then we rally and finish the game. And surviving, these are permanent buffs. The things, one once they are getting. Doesn't matter where we put it. Yeah, so uh, Lux's category is combo. And this is our combo. <laughs> so broken, yeah. When I played Lux for the first time, I'm like, what the hell is this shit? This is super strong. Even though we took a lot of it. And that's the only bad part about Lux's squad. Uh, barrier, this is actually good. We will uh, be able to stall the game a little with barrier units. Okay, let's see our support squad. Anything with that gives spells. Mm, this is not the worst if you think about it i don't want to use my reroll take uh caitlin shop on the left we go shop side caitlin's are cheap so we can play Kait caitlin units i mean same drill we'll keep the entire hand this time we might need to use this because you have a six mana spell on our hand already you just have to uh, you have to endure hit still yeah comes Lux comes, that's it. Oh, that's a lot of damage. High chance we have to play this, yeah. We'll play this because we're in a bad spot. I normally wouldn't play this, but I have to give my mana back. Okay, didn't actually help as much as that I thought it would. Best one more turn and we'll be fine. I think we're dead. Very high chance we're dead. Yep. 
Because he's gonna summon another one. Yeah, we're dead. Unlucky. Yeah, super unlucky. They're too fast. All of them are too fast. And not to mention the fact that we took a lot of damage last game. Oops. Yeah, what a way to start. Death on the second second fight. Yeah, this is gonna be fun. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, we can't play Lux, I guess. We have to play everything on the earlier parts of the game. Hopefully barriers are gonna help set. Yeah, we pass. Okay, you need our barrier, you need to stall. Unit's costing noise is pretty good. Okay, so... Don't block that. Uh, we don't block this. Survives, very good for us. We can barrier for next turn. We have six on us. We wanna play this first. Play this. Play this. The and play this. There we go. We have a bunch of units now. <laughs> they have three. These are all going to die. You're gonna get a shark. That's bad. She's a 7-7. Seven, seven. That sucks. So we wanna protect one of our units. Shark is coming here to remember that. Yeah, shark is coming. Okay, so highest damage are at 10, so block there, block here, uh, block here, and the rest should go here. Uh, yeah, there we go. We could endure a lot, so it should be fine. So this cost 3, we play it, we get our mana back, and we can play uh, Gatelyn. Hot on the trail. I could rally, yeah, but we can rally this turn as well. Much better. Full swing, then rally again. Then rally. There we go. One loss, but it's unfortunate. Mm, it doesn't matter even if you do this. Yeah, just keep at it. There we go. One unfortunate loss out of nowhere. But yeah, it's a two star path, so it's supposed to be difficult at times. I don't mention the fact that we didn't get any units early game. Yeah, what can you do with those losses? Uh, play with this. It helps us. It's a follower. It summons a follower and gives an extra follower. So it's pretty good. Uh, shop. Let's buy. When you target an ally with a single target spell, copy it onto your weakest ally. Uh, not that great. I can't buy it even. Let's reroll. Oh, can't even buy that. Waste of reroll. Oh, wait, shop, right? We can buy something. Uh, what can I get? It costs one. I'll take this one. Helps us pick, pick out specific targets. Contributes towards Lux level up as well. We are looking for slow and steady, man. Slow and steady means the game's over. That's over, I mean, uh, we'll keep this entire hand, fine. We always want to have one spell on our hand. Okay. That dude's 3-3, three, three, so we'll this. They won't attack. They're attacking. Oh, yeah, these grow. That's why they're attacking. Our units grow as well. We play the barrier unit next turn. Yeah, we play this guy. Give us our mana back. Plus gives two unit, not one. Nice, okay. So we will do this. Actually we can full swing, yeah. We have no reason not to full swing. We'll keep this, three mana for next turn. You can only do the mana refill once per turn. So you don't want to do it all the time. You want to do it once per turn. So these are fearsome, so we need this minimum three 
on a board. On the board. There we go. So we have two blockers. Three blockers. Yeah, this this combo is very good. Three mana, two bodies. A six plus spell. I don't have a six plus spell yet. This guy is still normal. So we'll full swing. If we get a six mana spell, then we get another rally. Yeah, there we go. Full swing. Let's see what they do. I think we can finish them off this turn. There we go. We played that. We played this. We get another rally. Five mana. All our mana back. Yeah, we'll finish this this turn. Damn, it gave us six mana spells, man. Yeah, this is... This units are super. Okay. This... Two... Oops. Yeah, give it to this one. Give honorable this one. Why is it passing? Oh, that's because it's not our attacking turn. That's why. Okay. So we do this. I will finish the game this turn. Attack like this. Drag it like this. Full swing. Then I can attack. Finish the game. Oh, we are finishing the game this turn. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, the three mana spell that summons a unit is very good. The problem is we're taking too much damage across the board with every path. I guess we'll buy a heal. I think to do better. Okay, it's too expensive. This contributes a gem. It's pretty good. Uh, contributing gem is much better. We get more mana. More mana is more valuable. What the hell is that? Um, there's only one way to find out. So let's go here. Soul culture. Heal 10 and add 2 copies of a spell with a blood prism to your deck. What the hell is a blood prism? Okay, heal 10 and add 2 copies. I cost 0. Deal damage to your nexus equal to my cost. I cost 0. If it costs 0, then I'm not taking any damage to face. Save your soul. Lose 10 nexus HP and add 2 copies of the spell with health to your deck. Oh, basically these heal and these take away. If it costs zero, then it's still damage to my cost. Original cost. Oh, basically these cost zero, but they do damage to your health three, which is the costing zero is very bad by the way, because it doesn't contribute towards your Lux level up. So we definitely want, don't want any of these. Heal your Nexus for 10. Yeah, I'm gonna go to two HP. Okay, I'm gonna go to two HP, it's fine. Heal your Nexus for 10, I will take it. I will take the 10 damage. Am I, I have 2 HP. I'm gonna come here and buy the full heal. For 175 gold, take the full heal, go back to 35. But that 6 mana will now heal me for 6. Which is crazy, yeah. This is a good combo. This is actually a good investment, in my opinion. This heals for 6 now. Super. I think that's crazy. Okay. So, we have to ha keep this in our hand. It's our way of refilling, uh, healing up. Okay, obviously didn't want two of them, but this dude is ex excellent to have. He gives us mana. Okay, they're attacking. They don't have any attack power. They don't have any attack power, so it doesn't really bother us that much. Let's bank the mana. We play this dude. We won't attack. This dude is gonna push us to turn five. And then we'll start playing this. Okay, Lux is also here. Absolutely gorgeous. So we'll play Lux, stun it. And we won't attack. Yeah, we go next and now we start the mayhem. Yeah, there we go. It shouldn't be problematic from this point onwards. Lux levels up. Pushing my limit. We got a moose. Okay, so these will actually... I don't know what happens. No, there's no scar ground, so... Shall we grow? Uh, kill that dude. It's gonna come back. That sucks. Forgot about the power again. Okay, anyways, we can play this. We can't. Uh, problematic, 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 problematic. Let's play another unit then. Oh, but we won't get a refill. Okay, it'll be a little wary. Okay. So let's attack with this one. Kill it. It's grown up. 
attack with this one. Take the trade on that, dude. Nah, let's not take any trade. Let's go next. Okay. So we can use it to take out this dude. Yeah, he permanently dies. Full swing, everyone. Okay, I'm full swing, everyone. Let's just do this. Take the trade here. The, these uh, these don't come back. You can only come back. Only one comes back, right? Yeah, only one comes back. The rest of them die. Okay, then rally again. Yeah, okay, that should do it. We play this, we get rally next turn and finish them off. This has grown. We play this, get a unit, get our mana back. Get a beam as well. Remember, only one comes back, not all of them. Play a challenger. I was once small like you. Okay, so what we want to do is if I do this, it survives, but it comes back to life. I think that's fine. Because he grows. He gets more damage. Yeah. So what we want to do is beam that, that dies. Pull challenger to the right. No more with the challenger to the right and finish them off. And actually we can do this as well. No, it doesn't matter. It's we don't need to stall. Oh, wait, we have to do it. Well, we don't have to do it. So we do this, rally, finish them off. We don't, just have, we don't have to play that, that's it. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, if you have your 6th spell and Lux on the board, the game's over. Yeah, 6th heal on that spell is absolutely worth it. What a bad way to start, but we're slowly getting into the thing. Okay, if challenger 2, Lux is pretty good. She comes on the board with barriers, so we'll never be able to get Caitlyn. Caitlyn's like five mana. Frost with the strongest is absolutely gorgeous. Stalls the game for us. Let's see what this is. Spells, item just. We're gonna go spell side. I mean, we're a spell heavy deck, right? Anything that's six plus is useful for us. Yeah, we don't want this, obviously. I don't want, I mean, by that I mean, I don't want Caitlyn. Lux is fine. Yeah, we have a one, we have a two. Yeah, this spell is so good. That sucks. Okay, we play our barrier in it. Uh, heal. We we'll take the heal and draw. See, barrier unit stalls again for us. So that's very good. Okay, so we'll play our this dude. Get more than one unit on the board. Yeah, super. That's actually very good if you think about it. Yeah, it hits it formidable. Yeah, super. This this spell with the follower summon is very good. You get two units for one. Okay, I could have played that. That was my bad. I actually I didn't need to. I did not take any phase damage yet. Okay, and one more turn. That dude is a little early. Okay, we'll take it. Okay, I'll take the five hit. I have ways to heal up. Not too worried about that. Um, play Lux stun the stun that thing, right? There we go. Also four. Okay, that died. <laughs> Funny. Okay, so let's take this out. Full swing. Full swing. Okay, we don't have to. This is fine. I think I'll take the entire hit. Yeah, not like I can do anything about it, but I'm just saying. Then I'll take this. It's fine. As long as you don't have units on the board, they don't have anything to sacrifice to get a higher unit. Next batches of units is when we're gonna go all in. Okay. The board management is bad. I will play this. Just to get a uh, yeah. Now we will the Fort Amasia. I can double Fort Amasia. It doesn't actually matter because we don't have overall. It would be ridiculous if we had overall. So, of all of us get for Damasia. Courage, soldier. Take this dude out. For Damasia again. 
We have triple rally, so it doesn't matter. The game is over, regardless of what happens. It doesn't even matter. Full swing, doesn't matter what you pull. They're gonna block, they're gonna rally and finish the game off anyways. They're capturing. It dies though. Yeah, it comes back again. This thing stays alive, but it comes back again. And stuns again. So we do this. Doesn't matter where we do it. That can't block. So we attack like this. 47. There we go. <laughs> We're gonna rally again. Nice, nice. Considering how we started off <laughs> losing to the second fight. Yeah, considering how we started off losing to the second fight, we're doing pretty good. Okay, okay, okay. okay. See, overround is very good. I'll take overround. We can get overround on everyone, that will be crazy. Okay, so you have to spell to add two copies of it. Obviously, I want a six mana spell, not another one. I'll take a, this. It helps throw away Thresh into the deck. What can I get? Game starts. Summon a frozen throw. Set its cooldown to five. These are very nice power, unique power to be exact. I'm gonna take this. So primal pack mentality is disgusting. I'm gonna take two of them. Pack mentality is disgusting. Okay, solo so this nice, nice, smooth soloist. Why am I saying solo smoothest? Okay, I'll go for there. If we get overrun on everyone, that would be ridiculous. That would be actually sealing the deal entire thing. That we, that's, that's the only thing that we technically need right now. We'll keep the six mana spell, three mana spell. This dude is excellent. He gives us one extra mana. Okay, Doom Beast. Tough places bring tough people. That's actually nice. Four one. Oh, uh, we'll attack first before they do anything. Yeah, we'll attack first. Super unlucky. We'll play the dude so because he gives extra mana. We go to turn five. Yeah, that's very important for us. Lux is here. Absolutely perfect timing. Play that. Stun it. Because she has barriers, so she can block it. Yeah, it's fine. We'll take a little hit this turn. But they're not attacking. attacking. But they are attacking. Oh, you block it like this, block it like this. This is dying, so. Oh, yeah, it's grow. And the shenanigans will start here. We'll play a unit and heal ourselves as well. And get rally and level up. Uh, we'll play this one again, even though it's not a refill. And next turn, we'll just put a Masi and rally and finish the game off. Play another one. Get another beam. Take out the big ones. Okay. Beam that, beam that. Rally, rally. They will eventually obviously run out of mana, so take out the bigger one though. Less damage to our team uh, units. You block it, attack, attack, full swing. This is gonna get traded here. We're okay with that. We can rally. Yeah, I think we, we're gonna finish it off this round. Yeah, this can't be blocked by that. So it doesn't matter. We have to pull. They're gonna sacrifice anyways, and that should do it. Yeah, we have enough damage. Lux in a nutshell. Yeah, Lux's squad is super strong. Especially 3 star Lux. And we don't even have the best power on Lux, which is slow and steady. Slow and steady just breaks the game. Okay. 3 Infernal. I don't want any of these. 6 mana. I'll take it. I have to take that. Yes. Can I get anything decent? When an ally dies for the first time, summon a uh, tomb, which we don't ne technically want. When you get the attack token, sapling. Also, I don't want. I'll take lurk. It's not that good, but I'll take it. Because so I don't need. I need both space. Okay, I have enough gold, right? I don't even need to do anything. I've cut something, right? 
Got this guy and girl out. Yeah. Okay, so this is the three star uh, thrush fight with our three star Lux. Let's do this. We lost our revive on the second fight, but that's okay. Hopefully, we're good. Last fight I fought here. His Vault of Helia got bugged out, meaning it wasn't working. Hopefully that won't happen. That was hilarious though. The Vault of Helia wasn't sacrificing anything for some weird reason. So we can't really do anything. We have means to, means to heal ourselves, so we're not worried. Yeah, this was not happening every turn for some weird reason. They got bugged out. This is happening this time. Okay, so what we want to do is we office off. We don't want to play this guy first. He's gonna give us the extra mana. Uh, Lux is gonna come out this turn. Even though we are turn four, we are technically for turn five because this guy gives us extra mana. Super. So Lux is already on the board, and next turn we're gonna start our combo. Trish is also here. Take it out. Okay, he's actually going for units. He's doing. Oh god, I didn't even see that. He's doing six. Never mind. Thank god for that. Okay, okay. So this is our turn where we are supposed to start, start the combo. Uh, I don't even have ways to do it. Okay, let's summon more units. Hey, you would actually kill Dox if I didn't have that power, if you think about it. Damn. This sucks. Could be worse. Yeah. Well, what have we here? Okay, we are at turn. We have eight on us. Can we do anything with eight? Locks will level up. So what we can do is play this and they play pack mentality. Play this. My shield is yours. And then play pack mentality. Uh, we'll beam down all uh, on uh, Thresh. Beam him first. Actually, we him second, right? We should do it second. This. We are okay with that. Beam him. Do extra damage. Should we rally? I don't think we should rally. Actually, we can rally. We'd get more value out of it though. Okay, we can devil up and then rally, of course. And then rally. Doesn't matter where we give it. Okay, because we're gonna pull that dude with uh, locks anyways. So this is the one. 26 damage, 22 damage. Yeah, there we go. That box and files is just disgusting. Keep one alive, always. I have no idea how did he get me back. Yeah. Haunted Tomb, oh, obviously Haunted Tomb. Forgot about that. Get our rally back. And grow our units. Who should get it? This guy. He's the lowest one on the board. Thresh will go for him. Her, I mean. We do this full swing. Super. Almost done. And, and this ne next turn's rally should just finish it off. Actually, I could have used this to rally. I think we get rally back, right? If we do this. No, we don't. Okay. And full swing and finish the game. There we go. Nice, nice. Super, super. There we go. It was a little tricky. We lost to the second fight, which was hilarious, but we finished it. Okay. Okay, so three star trash fight done with our three star Lux. Let's see what we get. Expect a B or a C because we died. 
Yes, I have no idea how did I get S, considering the fact that I died. Okay, anyways, champion attachment and power top time. Okay, the two powers I have is Ludens Tempest, meaning all the spells and skills do one extra damage. We have whenever she is played on the board, the strongest enemy gets stunned, Everfrost, and she has a challenger which we got during the path. Moving on to the powers, all allies that has three or less that cost three or less are lurkers. Horrible power, we just took it for because the others were even worse. Um, Stunning, the uh, force fighting the strongest enemy on the board every round. Very good power. We saved us from Lux dying in the last fight. Whenever units uh, survive, they get plus one plus one, which is very good because Fortamasia gives everyone plus three plus three, and when they attack and uh, they get blocked, they actually grow by one, which is good, permanent. Uh, this is Lux's three star power, I believe. Each round, the first time you play a spell, refill the mana equal to its cost meaning whatever spell you're gonna play you're gonna get that much mana back like six spells if you play first one so if you play a six mana spell on the first turn on the fir first time in one round you get six back four four back three three back but the only the first spell which is ridiculous because you know her squad entirely revolves around playing spells especially six mana ones okay so this is um the luxus two star power every game starts you get one extra mana and whenever you play six plus spell a mana of spells meaning sum of six spells not necessarily a six mana spell like two three spells or three two two mana spells you get a golden ingus zero mana golden ingus which is not which is not fleeting which is permanent it stays in your hand which is crazy and of course last but not least your game starts you heal your nexus for two that's about it <laughs>